Good morning, North Park Church. You've heard us talking about faith life. Let me tell you about the next steps that we want you to take. So go into your email account. You would have received an email at some point in the past year, if you've been around North Park at all, with a title, Faith Life, but from Diana Rush at North Park Church, inviting you to join our Faith Life account. If that is not the case, you can email Diana Rush at northparkebc.org, and she will send you an invitation to sign up. So for those of you who have not done this yet, and there's at least two-thirds of our church who has not followed through on this, please open that email. Click Join Group down in the lower part of the email. That will open up the Faith Life account, and then you will want to go and click on the top right-hand side. You'll have a little icon up there. Click on that. Click on the profile and go in and then look at your contact information. So go ahead and just click edit. That way it brings it all up. Once the page loads, go ahead and make sure your profile is a good self-portrait of yourself. This will help others in our church know who you are, be able to connect names and faces. So pick one that you would like to have on there. Again, it's a small little thumbnail, but it will be helpful of letting others know who you are. Then make sure you have the right name for who you are. If you want to tell somebody about yourself, go ahead and write a short bio. The most important parts, though, that we ask you to fill out are the contact information sections. So go ahead, open up this, and then make sure you have a correct home address. Some of you have moved. Some of you have transitioned into different housing. Make sure that that is up to date along with your preferred phone number and email. So I know some of you transition emails from time to time. Please make sure that the email that you want us to be contacting you is that one right there. The rest of that information is very interesting. If you want to add some more things, you can. Under the faith section, there is an important one called spiritual gifts. You can feel free to identify the ones that you think you'd want us to know and how you'd want us to plug you in around the church. You can also choose your visibility and how much people can actually see of your account. Now, I realize putting your information online, people feel very vulnerable about that, and I completely understand. This information will only be accessible to those who also have a Faith Life account through North Park Church. So you'll have to log in and have this platform available to you before you can access anybody else in our church. Once you've completed updating your information, you might be wondering, well, how do I get a hold of that other person? That, uh, see, who is that John I know? Well, go back up here, click on the Faith Life icon, click on North Park Church, and then down here on the column on the left-hand side, you'll see the word directory. That gives you access to our entire church that has signed up and has updated their information. And so you can use that. I'm not going to open it here. But just know that it is there, it's available to you, and for those who put their pictures in, you'll be able to identify faces and names and know the people of North Park Church. And this is a tool that we hope will connect you better. Now some of you might want to do this on your app. Here's how you do that. Go into your Play Store, whether that's Apple or whether it's Google, type in Faith Life. You will see Faith Life Community, Church Community come up. Go ahead, click on that, download that on your phone, and then all this information about the people you love and know at North Park Church will be on this app and available to you on your phone. All right, everybody. We hope you're able to go home and do this quickly. Right now, we have about a third of our church who's updated their information. We want the other two-thirds to be updated as well. If you need help, there will be people, myself included, in the lobby after the service helping you make sure your information is up to date. Look forward to helping you and helping our church stay connected. Thank you.